In previous versions of Vectorworks, the shadows in OpenGL were not directly representative of how light would be cast across 3D geometry. Now, when shadows are enabled in OpenGL, as long as you have a video card that supports it, you'll see realistic lighting and shadows in the basic OpenGL renderings, similar to the more complex Renderworks rendering modes. This has dramatic applications in design series versions of Vectorworks for both interior lighting design and exterior solar studies. For this example, we'll disable textures for a shorter rendering time, then turn out the lights, enabling only one light object so that we can aim it wherever we'd like. It can be time consuming to set up a number of interior lights, align them as you think they should be, then wait a few minutes for a rendering to complete before you can determine whether you had the alignment correct or not. Now in OpenGL, we can render a real-time update on what a light object will be doing as we modify it in the Object Info Palette. As you can see, adjusting both the tilt and pan gives nearly immediate feedback, allowing more direct and rapid control of this directional light. To demonstrate its abilities in exterior rendering, we'll use the Heliodon tool, included in a design series version of Vectorworks, which allows us to set the date, time, and location, giving us an exact representation of where the sun will be at any point. We can see how moving the time slider shows what different points the building will be subjected to what amount of sunlight during the day. With this other slider, we can see the changes depending on the exact time of year as well. This seemingly simple update can actually be used to great effect without having to wait for the slower but more detailed render works modes in order to calculate your lighting and shadows. Thank you for joining us, and don't forget to visit kbase.vectorworks.net for more video tech tips and other technical articles. Thank you, and have a great day.